Hi, my name is Isabella Arrington, and my presentation is how to improve FCCLA membership. So, I believe one way we can improve membership is by the use of social media. I know I personally follow the Instagram page, and I don't really see it pop up as much as I feel like I should. Um, so, I think we should encourage daily posts, or even a weekly post. Um, setting challenges for our chapters to achieve, and the way that they enter those challenges is by putting it on our social media account or sending it to a state officer. And then we could even have a prize at our at state conference honoring the chapters or awarding the chapters for their involvement. Um, and then next is bringing a friend. Um, and the use of social media really helps with that because every teenager, majority of teenagers are on social media. And so by advocating for that, the more you post, the more people that are going to be involved. Um, yeah, so the use of social media. So next, going out into our community and having an open communication and dialogue. I know my school personally only has one high school and one FCCLA program um, or a chapter. So I feel like we can go out, in, or my personal experience, go out to our middle schools and try to create some involvement from there um and just going out into our community and letting them know about this amazing program and what it stands for talking about our motto and our creed and our mission statement and hope how, how we are shown to be leaders of america and then just again letting people know what this program represents and how it's changed lives at least i know it's personally changed my life going out into our community and lastly having fun events um i know you can create great membership and get more people involved when they're having fun and of that previous program i was involved in did a volunteer day and we went out to our community made some made a difference and then we had fun games and it brought people back people came because they enjoyed and the relationships they had built Creating a welcoming environment, you'll retain members when everybody feels included because when you're in high school, that's all anybody really wants. And then just going back to that, building relationships. <laughs> Lastly, how to retain and keep uh, retain current and new members. Uh, maintaining that friendly, inclusive environment. Again, building those relationships, which are really important. Positive communication. Um... And then just a friendly and positive demeanor towards others. Anyway, that's my presentation. Um,